hi everyone welcome back to the channel and in this video we are going to discuss how to run anaconda code from powershell over here in a spider i have written one sample code which is just going to print hello anaconda along with that i have imported pyplot from matplotlib and this module is available in conda virtual environment now let me run this code so it's running fine now this file i have saved into this folder location so let me open this and now i'm going to copy the file path so press shift and right click and copy as a path now i'm going to run this python code from powershell Python and get the path and uh, now I got error like module not found error because matplotlib is not available in my local Python installation. So in order to activate uh, Conda virtual environment, what we have to do is uh, just go to the go to the folder where you have installed anaconda and from there open cell folder and inside the cell folder you will find one more folder like conda bin and over here we have one conda hook power cell script so i'm going to copy the path sam shift and right click copy the path and to it over here remove the codes i'm now going to run this webhook now you can see like i got the error like unauthorized because in my machine i i do not have access to execute the power cell script so in order to resolve this uh, issue we can go to this link or I have just created one blog so let me first try to get what is the access level currently available for current user so to add this and you can see it's undefined so what I have to do is I have to give access to the current user so I'm going to give this access say yes now access has been granted now let's check and you can see right now i have the access so let's rerun this conda hook power cell script and this time it, it it's like work fine now what i have to do is i have to activate this conda like a virtual environment and for that you you need to get uh, this folder location and then type conda activate and then keep the path where anaconda has been installed press enter now you can see it is right now pointing to the base virtual environment so if i'm going to rerun the code over here this time you can see i got the output like hello anaconda so in order to de deactivate this virtual environment what you have to do is type conda deactivate and it has been deactivated now so thank you for watching